What is going on guys, welcome back to another player review. We are going to be looking at international man of the match Higuain for his goal yesterday and he looks incredible when you look at his card stats but this guy actually deserved a team of the season card but he never got one. Now I tried the second inform who who was okay, he wasn't exactly amazing or anything like that. Now I bought this guy for around 200k so pretty expensive for the sort of stats you're looking at for Higuain. Now he is going to be getting um, cheaper throughout the day so I will hold on to your coins until the end of the day or maybe until you know the team of the tournament for later on this week now if you guys are looking for a cheap reliable place to get your coins check out battle.com their link will be in the description and use the code itani to get five percent off now his biggest selling point is going to be his shooting and i felt there is a huge upgrade with his shooting a lot better than the second inform this guy is shots you will see an incredible long shot at the start of this video and at the end at the end the the player stopped playing so that long shot was when he wasn't playing but as you guys know you don't control the goalkeeper anyway and I still managed to score it now really good finesse shots he had a couple that hits the crossbar but he's definitely capable of scoring finesse shots because his finishing is pretty damn high so no problem scoring with him in the penalty area and he has good heading and height not amazing I didn't find him much of an aerial threat but he gets you a header here and there so don't expect him to be a Mandzukic or anything like that he has that full star weak foot so it makes it easier to finish with his left foot in the penalty area Decent strength, didn't find him the most, well, the strongest uh, player I have tried or anything like that. I found him okay when it came down to trying to bully off defenders or just try and hold on to the ball and pass it over to Obabo. So he wasn't exactly that strong, he was okay um, because his aggression is always pretty low. I mean, EA never tried to upgrade his aggression. Okay, dribbler, didn't like his agility because his agility is quite shit. So you're going to find your, yourself very hard to turn with him and that is something I disliked about. Higuain. I had to try and fake shot my way around defenders to be able to get past them. This guy's got three star skills so not only isn't he agile but skillers won't be able to achieve everything they want from him. Now he also is out of position frequently and this is something that I found that sort of kills his card that medium and medium work rate just really piss me off. Now I would see him as a target man but a lot of the time he waits outside the penalty area when I want to cross it in especially on counter attacks he is nowhere to be found so keep that in mind if you're looking of purchasing him and I think his balance make him feel a lot weaker than he actually is he has decent strength stats his aggression balance just make him seem pretty weak and he falls onto the ground every time or a lot of the time when the defenders try and get him off the ball so overall he's a good player decent pace very good finisher okay dribbler if you minus the agility full star weak for good heading and height really good finesse shots and awesome shot power and long shots his positioning kills him in my opinion three star skills agility sucks and balance sucks as well if you had to compare if i had to compare him between the second inform and th this international man of the match card the only difference i found was his shooting it is incredible it seems a lot better than the second inform but that is about it when it comes down to upgrades so hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did i'd really appreciate a like make sure you drop down in the comment section below who you would like me to review next the international man of the match cards i think we've done most of the attacking ones so let me know in the comment section below hope you guys enjoyed it and hope you guys have a very nice day.